What's going on everybody? Well if you haven't already noticed by the thumbnail or the car sitting behind me, I bought a new car. I bought a 2022 Elantra N and I'm quite excited about it. This is the first car that I'm actually having a car payment on. You know, the things like the GTR, the Neon, the MR2, that was all paid in cash. So this is my first time ever having a car note, trying to build up my credit for uh, ideas later down the road. Well, let's, uh, let's take a walk around and show you guys my brand new, like I said, 2022 Elantra N in Cyber Gray. Quick walk around of the exterior. Uh, honestly, the Cyber Gray is by far my favorite color in these cars. I always told myself the next new car I bought was going to be a, a white car, and these do come in white. But honestly, this Cyber Gray was just a I had to get. Now, your question to me is, is it a manual or is it an automatic? Well, if you know these cars fairly well and know that I'm in the United States, already know that answer. Or should know the answer, I should say. I'm not going to say you do know, but you should know that answer already. But for everybody else, it is a manual. Which I'm quite excited to have a three pedal car. Now you ask why do I say you should know? It's because in the United States a manual transmission car does not get a sunroof. Now, I got this car when it had seven miles on it fresh off the truck. Take a look at the back. I'm just gonna do a quick walk around. There's a siphoning bars that are back there. This car did come <laughs> with the first aid kit and the trays and a couple extra things. These cars do not come with spares. They come with that awesome uh, <laughs> inflator kit. I might add a spare to this car, we'll see. It is just an awesome car. All right, so we all know the next question at hand, right? Are you keeping the stock? And the answer is absolutely not. Uh, one thing I'm gonna do is gonna tint the windows. That's gotta get done. I hate you know, hate fishbowl. Everything I own is tinted, so this is gonna get tinted here soon. Wheels and tires. So I'm either gonna do two things. I'm either gonna get a really nice set of summer wheels and take these tires and put those on if I can find, you know, if I like the offset in size or buy another set that I'm going to be happy with to run in the winter time because the tires on here are the Michelin Pilot uh, 4S's which are summer tires so these are not going to do well in the winter time. I did buy this to daily so so I'll either have, need to buy another set of wheels so I can put these tires onto those for summertime or buy a set of and obviously buy these uh, all seasons or buy myself a set of wheels that I'm going to be okay with running during the winter time and putting all seasons on those. I have already bought a couple mods for this car. I bought Boomba bushings, uh, shifter bushings. I bought the Boomba transmission adapter and I bought the Boomba blow off valve. So those videos are going to be coming up here shortly as soon as those parts come in. There's a couple other things I want to buy for the car. We'll see down the road what I'm actually going to do. But my idea right now is to do things that are, uh, well, the, the shifter stuff is a nut, um, a must. So one thing I've noticed in this, in this car, I've driven it about 300 miles so far, and the shifter likes to not go into gear all the time properly. I've read up on it. I know it's a normal issue. Uh, buying bushings are definitely gonna help that. I have bushings in the neon, bushings and everything, you know, upgrade bushings and everything I own. So that's obviously mental. That's first, one of the very first things I'm gonna do. The adapter changes a lot as well, and it's supposed to inc uh, increase, you know, uh, perform driving performance and decreased throw so we'll see what happens there then the blow-off valve obviously is where psh, psh, noises so uh, stay tuned for those videos if you haven't yet guys please subscribe to the channel like squad go smash that like button for me until next time peace out